Welcome to Toffee TV. It is the Everton News Daily. Everton have been linked with Brighton's right back today, Tariq Lamptey. The players just signed a new contract for Brighton uh, and only joined the club last summer from Chelsea. But uh, apparently that is not putting Everton off or a few other top clubs off in pursuit of the right back. Who's really impressed this season, come from nowhere um, and just loves to raid down that right. Is He's a bit more of a right wing back than a, than a right back, but it's an Everton need someone to take Seamus's, Seamus Coleman's place for uh, the next, well, for the next five or six years, don't they really? So if you brought a player like that in who's got that kind of sp speed, I'm sure we could teach him how to be a defender as well. Um, but yeah, it's a bit of an unusual one, I must admit, considering the players just signed a new contract, but obviously... When when um, players sign new contracts, it just pumps their value up. So I'm sure Everton and other clubs probably didn't think they would have got the play beforehand cheap, and and that price tag has just gone up even further. Um, it's an interesting link, and we'll have to see what happens. Everton apparently locked locked in talks with Bayern Munich over Joshua Zerksy. We did speak about him on Friday. Uh, other clubs are interested as well, including Palmer in. Italy, 19-year-old, would be a loan with an option to buy for around 10 million euros. That's what's being discussed. Uh, although it has been said that it would be difficult, a difficult situation for Everton with with it uh, financially. But it won't go away. It's a strange one. This one, it won't go away. Only 24 hours before the link, we heard from Marcel Brand saying there wouldn't be any incomings. But this link won't go away. Um, and is back on back out today. So this might just be Xerxes representatives trying to get, you know, another club involved to take the player who was down the peck and order now at Bayern Munich. So uh, but at nineteen, you know, on loan, would it be the worst move for Everton to go in that direction? We'll have to wait and see whether there's anything genuine in that. Uh, Everton play Liverpool tonight in the mini derby, the under twenty threes. Um it is gonna be on Everton's YouTube channel, I believe it's uh, the game's getting played at Southport. Uh, they haven't played, I don't think, for about a month. So, good opportunity for some of the young players to get um, to play because it's been a while for them. It's always a hotly contested game. That, well, yeah. Hopefully, Everton's under twenty threes can do better than they do normally, and normally, and and the first team do normally as well. Um, and it's a big happy birthday today to Bob Latchford, 70 years old today. He's over there in Germany, probably enjoying himself, having a couple of glasses of wine as we speak. So happy birthday to him because you know what? He probably was your dad's favourite player ever. So that deserves a big shout out as far as we're concerned. Uh, make sure to check out this week and next week. All our transfer dailies, whether they be on Everton or just in the Premier League or the or Europe as a whole, we're going to be doing them in, in over the next couple of weeks because it's transfer deadline day two weeks tomorrow. So make sure you check that out because in two weeks tomorrow we'll be doing stuff with Ball Street again, being a four-hour special over on um, the Ball Street YouTube channel to watch. We'll be doing our own things as well on the day. Um, I'm not sure how much there'll be to go on, but... We'll have to wait and see in a couple of weeks. So make sure to check them out during this week and next week. Make sure to give this video a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you want more great videos, join us over on Patreon for daily live videos. You can uh, subscribe by clicking the link, which is around here. Just down there. There you go. See you later.